Well, for more on the Conservative primary and the battle ahead for the Elysee Palace, I'm joined by Skype from London by Renaud Tillier, the Deputy Director at the Policy Network Think Tank. Thank you so much uh, for joining us here on France 24 uh, this morning. Uh, just to start with, who do you think won that debate and have they done enough to win over the French public at large? Well, I, I think there was no clear way winner of, of the debate. Um, uh, basically, what was expected is that Juppé would be on the offensive and would, tr would try to uh, destabilize uh, Fillon because he's the, the outsider now. Uh, but it didn't really happen, actually, so it was a pretty even. Um, uh, the debate was polite, respectful, and uh, I think Juppé didn't really manage to strike any fatal blow uh, which would have um, allowed him to uh, come back into the race. Um, foreign policy played a very small part in last night's debate. So what, what do you say, think this says about uh, how the race will be fought on the whole? It's true that um, uh, it was mainly economic and social issues and also um, identity issues, ethical issues, which were prominent. Um, Europe, for instance, was not mentioned at all, uh, which was uh, a big surprise. Um, I think it's telling about the, the sense of uh, domestic crisis uh, that exists in France, uh, both on the on the economic side, but also on the on the social and identity side. Uh, so clearly, th these are things people want to talk about, and uh, there's perhaps less the feeling that France has, I mean, can afford doing many many things in the world. So it should probably focus a bit more on uh, uh, fixing the, the problems uh, at home. Well, surprising uh, you say that Europe wasn't mentioned very much, particularly since this is one of the, the clubs that Marine Le Pen uses to um, wield quite uh, heavily. Uh, she is widely assumed to be the candidate that either of these two men uh, will be facing. Uh, who would you say is best placed to beat her uh, in the uh, presidential elections? Well, I mean, that, 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 that's an interesting question and, and people disagree. So uh, a lot of people think that Juppé would be a better candidate because he would manage to uh, attract left-wing voters on his name uh, in, in a runoff um, uh, where he would face Marine Le Pen. But actually, uh, I, I think Fillon is, is a stronger candidate and uh, is more difficult for Marine Le Pen because he appeals to uh, various constituencies on the right, uh, the socially conservative, the, the economically liberal. Um, he has been sending quite strong signals on identity, which are similar to the one Nicolas Sarkozy used to, to, to send. Um, so I think for, uh, for Marine Le Pen, Fillon would be less of an easy target than, than Juppé would be. OK, Renaud Tillier, a deputy director at the Policy Network Think Tank. Thank you so much uh, for speaking to us here on France 24 this morning. We do appreciate it.